We're back with Brandy Taylor, her team of eye surgeons, Dr. Brian Boxer Walkler and Dr. Kenneth Wright. Docs, what did you find in your evaluation, but more importantly, is there any hope? What we found was that the attack ripped off the lower muscle, and as a result, the eye floated up. And she's keeping her eyes, her eye closed, not because um, she can't open it, it's because with both eyes open, it's like two car headlights that are, you know, disengaged from being in alignment, and she gets terrible double vision. I just have to say, as a doctor, hearing what you've gone through, this is, this is not what humanity is about. And the good news is we do have some great news for you. Yeah, I think we have some very positive news from the MRI. We found that the muscle is there. The inferior rectus muscle that was ripped off, pulled back behind the eye. And we, I, brought, I brought a model. Uh, the inferior rectus muscle is down below and it holds our eye in place. Well, it was ripped off with the trauma. And the other doctor tried to find it, <clears throat> but it was too far back. I think we have a chance of retrieving the muscle and bringing it back and restoring your normal vision to single binocular vision. And we're gonna make that happen for you. It's gonna be a team effort to make this happen for you and to give you back what right now had been taken away. Now in the meantime, before the surgery's done, we had made glasses based on the prism measurements that we made of your eye in the office. And these glasses have a special prism put in there so that it's going to compensate for the damaged muscle so that this will make your eyes in alignment again so you can, in the meantime, be with your eyes open and not have the double vision. And you can start that right now. On top of, of your double vision, you mentioned seeing the scars and looking in the mirror. And I want to introduce you to oculoplastic surgeon, Dr. Christopher Zumalan, who'd like to say something to you. I'm going to be with you during this process as you continue to heal. I'll be working with this wonderful team of ophthalmologists uh, during your first surgery. And once your double vision has been improved, we can then focus on reconstructing your eyelid, improving the scar tissues uh, with some uh, revisional surgeries, with or without laser resurfacing. <laughs> so much to me, not just because of looks, but it's, it's who I am. A lot of times you all don't see what happens in between breaks or when I meet a guest before we start rolling the cameras. And what you said to me was, you're, you're here, I want to make sure you're comfortable, you're here because you want to help other people. Right. So despite everything that happened to you, despite everyone watching what happened to you, being horrified, here you are. You didn't come here for you. You came here to share your story to hopefully prevent this from happening to someone else, and that's why you deserve all this.